everyone and welcome back to my channel welcome if this is your first time here this week's sweet treat is peanut butter cups this recipe is technically only four ingredients and the recipe info can be found in the description box along with links to products that I use in this video and while you're here don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button and notification bell to be notified of new recipes first the first thing for this recipe is to line a muffin pan with paper liners or you can use silicone liners and this recipe will make about 10 to 12 peanut butter cups. So you want to take your chocolate chips and coconut oil and melt them in the microwave in 30 second increments stirring in between until it's smooth just like this. Using a spoon or a measuring cup, add enough chocolate to cover the bottom of the liner and then you want to place this muffin pan in the freezer for 5-10 to 10 minutes to allow the chocolate to set. Now I used half and half of chocolate, I used half milk chocolate chips and then half semi-sweet chocolate chips. But you can choose to use just strictly milk chocolate or strictly semi-sweet. In a separate bowl, add peanut butter, honey, and coconut oil. And you want to microwave this for 15 to 30 seconds and then stir to combine. You want this mixture to be pourable. Remove the muffin tin from the freezer and pour the peanut butter mixture evenly over the chocolate mixture and then you want to place this back into the freezer for another 5 minutes. For the top layer of chocolate, we're just going to repeat the steps that we did in the beginning. You want to add your one cup of chocolate chips and your coconut oil and then microwave in 30 second increments, stirring in between until it's smooth. Remove your muffin pan from the freezer and pour the chocolate over the peanut butter mixture. Now you're going to place it back in the freezer for one last time for 30 minutes to one hour until this is completely set. And lightly tapping the muffin pan on the counter allows the chocolate to evenly spread out. Once they are completely set, you can remove them from the freezer and you can remove the paper liners or the silicone liners. And then you can place these in an airtight container in the refrigerator until you're ready to serve them. Or if you want these to be a bit softer, allow them to sit on your counter until ready to serve. The peanut butter mixture remains pretty soft with these peanut butter cups while the chocolate firms up and has a bit of a crunch to it which I like. So please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching and if you are not subscribed yet please join the family before you go and turn on all notifications to be notified the moment a new recipe goes live. Thank you all for joining me today and until next time take care of yourself and each other. While you're still here, check out some of my other most recent videos.